There's plenty of things that I've done that my parents don't know about. You sneaky son of a gun. I honestly wanted to make a video on this kid because he reminds me of every white kid from my hometown that bought an airsoft pistol and then took pictures of it in their bedroom with their phone and all of their homies. I know you're laughing because you know exactly the little weird fuckers I'm talking about. You probably know over 10 of them. Anyways, back to NWA's fattest white boy. What people don't know is when I had the van, I actually got pulled over by the police and the cop didn't do anything. He didn't call my aunt. He knew neither one of us had a license. Dude, be quiet. There's a cop behind us. Can you roll down the window? I'm a cop. You see my badge? I love guns and titties. Dude, my dad watches like every cop's episode. Just roll the window down or he will shoot you. No, I'm gonna be a little gangster like Tupac. Fuck 12, bitch. I'm gonna give you one more opportunity to roll this window down or I'm gonna have to bust it down. Man, fuck you, I'm out of here. Dude, don't run, he'll shoot you. Uh, 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 he's running, he's running. You can't catch me. Fuck 12, bitch. Got him. <laughs> oh. Was that too realistic for you? My bad. I carry a gun because people know I sell weed and if you don't have a gun and you sell weed, then you're just putting a target on your back. This kid straight up thinks he's a certified drug dealer just because he has Tupac and Little Boosie on his playlist. I sell weed. That's why I got a gun, dude. West side, motherfucker! When I'm carrying guns, I always have at least one, sometimes two or three. Look how big he's smiling like he's been waiting his whole fucking life just to tell somebody he's a gangster. You know, I carry like, you know, one, two, three guns, you know, because I'm a gangster. Shit. At the moment, my guns right now are all at my friend's house. Well, gangster dude, I hate to burst your uh, little gang banging ass bubble, but uh, you just ratted your friends out for having your uh, illegal shit at their house. Yeah, you're a, you're a terrible gangster. I have a .40 Smith & Wesson. He just said he has a .40 Smith & Wesson. You mean a Smith & Wesson 40 caliber? A 9mm and a 380. I've even robbed someone for a gun before, even though I knew how risky it was. All you do is walk up to them, ask them to see the gun that you're trying to buy. They'll take the clip out, hand it to you, and you can just have a spare clip in your back pocket, slide the clip in and tell them to walk. I don't know if I'm the only one to notice this, but Homeboy just dead ass admitted to fucking robbing people on national television. I'm not really scared of getting locked up, but I know if I keep going and how I'm going now, I will lose my life. I've probably broken into five or six houses. Breaking into a home has its risk because they could be home, they just didn't answer the door when you knocked, and if they hear the glass break in the back and they do have a gun, you know they will shoot. Okay, well, you admitted to, like, robbing people of their guns and then having your guns at your friend's house so you sold your friends out, and then now you just admitted to breaking into houses, which is burglary. Yeah. G good luck leaving, Dr. Phil. <laughs> okay, so you've robbed people of their guns. Yes, sir. And you've burglarized five or six houses. Yes, sir. He, and what the hell are you thinking? He found he knew about the last house because he read text and woke me up and said, County's on the way to pick you up. Uh basically I shouldn't have to say anything for this one, same old, same old as your kid. Discipline your son. Uh he shouldn't be able to leave the house doing bad shit. Hey, you know, you're on your fucking own. If you're gonna fuck up and do stupid shit like that, you're gonna get arrested and I'm not gonna help you. You know, you stab yourself in the back, you stab your damn self in the back. You're burglarizing houses. How long have you been doing this? Uh, most of it happened while I was on the run for the past week or two. He's ran away twice, all of this. Has been in the happening. last two weeks? Last yeah. three weeks. He was gone a week, and then he was home for the four or five days at, the, mm -hmm. at his aunt's, and mm -hmm. then disappeared again with the band. Okay, and so in, in these, what do you get out of these five or six houses that you burglarized? Uh, most of guns or just whatever's in the house. Uh-huh. Uh, how many guns did you steal? Four or five. Somebody needs to shoot this kid in the damn leg, teach him a lesson. And this was all in the town where you live. Mm -hmm. And you didn't do this alone, you did it with others? Yeah, the two kids that I were with just got um, 
they just bonded out, but they just got booked on two burglary charges for a different house. Hey, if uh, any up and coming white kids are like aspiring to be a gangbanger because your iPod has a little boosy on it, this kid, he's a great, he, uh, he tattles, he, he'll, he'll give you up. He, he admits to the, the wrongdoings of the crimes that he commits to be a certified gangster. He's, uh, n yeah, you, yeah, you don't want to fuck with this guy. Do you realize that you've just confessed to five or six home burglaries? on videotape, on national television, and you set the time frame and the location. God dang, son. This kid is fucking nuts, man. Dude, this kid's basically like, hey, hey, arrest me. I did some fucked up shit. <laughs> yeah, be disappointed. You definitely fucked up this time. Okay, wait, this is my bad. This kid knows everything about everything. That's why he became a gangster. Because he knows all about that street life and that shit. Fool. Okay, kids. Bottom line, this shit ain't cool. Go out, go get an education. Be a welder, build trucks, build razors, whatever you want to do. Be a movie star, I don't care. Don't aspire to be a gangster. They don't go no fucking where. They just ride around fucking on Instagram live with their guns talking about how they're going to beat up Kevin Gates and all their stupid shit. And it never fucking happens. But TMZ would tell you that it probably will. But don't watch TMZ because they're fucking liars like CNN. See y'all. Have a nice day.